time to come along with me and Mickey because it's been a, a small world after all. A world of frustrating, agonizing fears and festering tears. But Christ's perfect love can come and wash all of that away within a moment of but a moment within an instant of an instant. So at this Christmas time, as the blood red nose of Rudolph moves us into uh, a time of reflection this year, 2022, uh, let us realize that even though it is just a moment away from midnight, the Lord's, the Lord's arms have never been too short to save. So come along with me and Mickey, my good buddy, and let's get excited because it's a blessed time of the year to lift up our majesty of majesties, our hero of heroes, icon of icons is he, is Emmanuel, our roaring lion of Zion, who is roaring as loudly as little itty bitty kitty, teeny weeny tiniest gentle silent purr because it's not by power nor is it by might but it is only going to be by the spirit of love one heart at a time that the age of the lion and the lamb can yet be manifested so know that the Lord is making a way where it has seemed that there has been none he is pulling down the mountains, lifting up the valleys, so one loving people might stand under one loving God. This is the restoration of Acts 3, 21. And if it does not happen, Christ in no way can return, says the word of God. And so get ready for this blessed Christmas. And I bring to you the secrets of of the Lord's heart of hearts, the secret of his heart that he whispered not only to myself, but to Cahill Gabran and to House of Beloved Shiasa. And in this hour of love's greatest power being poured out upon all spirit, uh, up, uh, his spirit being poured out upon all flesh, rather as Joel 2 and Acts 2 says, for the latter days as that's happening we must get now get excited and it came to pass that as the Lord revealed his word for this hour he came forth and gave me a vision of the same one Cahill Gabran had a vision of the bride of Christ and he let me understand that all the, the uh, foolish virgins are those who do not f fill their lamp. Uh, those are the ones who have imagined that the bridegroom is, has abandoned them and is not returning for them. So they stop caring about much and as they let their love die because of bitterness uh, for the same love that makes many better makes many bitter if people refuse to see that miracles truly are all around us. Everything we see is a miracle manifested for us. And the Lord is a good God who has never been an angry, judgmental, condemning God as most people have imagined wrongly. For the word of God that supersedes all others is found in the word of Jeremiah 110, Haggai 2 2, that God wants to tear down all kingdoms of man's imagination, not born solely upon his conditional love, as I change uh, my camera here a little bit. And so it's time to uh, get with the program of having your camera straight. There you go, I should have did that before. But one thing for sure, if I ever get my camera right, <laughs> it is time for the blessings of love, so get ready, here it comes. <laughs> 